That was very nice. Thank you, son. <laughs> what about me? What? I made the custard. <laughs> yeah, you opened the tin. <laughs> I had to heat it up, though. Three buttons on a microwave. <laughs> yeah, well, it's still warm me out. In fact, I think I need to go for a pint to get over it. Uh, who's being? He is. <laughs> I'll get my jacket. Now, I'm only staying for the one. I don't want to be there all afternoon. Yeah, right. Ah, he's been in all week older. Hey. Poor Trev. I don't want to pull his cracker whip. Yeah. He's in there. Hi. Hello, darling. Do you have a nice time? Yeah. Listen, I'm sorry I'm late. It's just that, um, Zoe's back and, uh, you know, I lost track of all time. That's all right, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. You're here now. That's what matters. Come on. Keep your dinner warm. Oh, it's lovely. Sit yourself down. as your grand makes it. No. No, I'm really sorry. It's just that Zoe was back. I was so excited and I just forgot that. I know. And you'd rather spend time over there with your family than with me on Christmas, eh? No, no. Oh, so you still want your dinner? <laughs> I seem to have thrown it on the floor, though. Never mind. <laughs> when you do stuff like this. I just get so wound up, you know, knowing that you'd rather be over there with them than with me. That's not true. I told you, Cat brought Zoe back. I couldn't just leave. Do you know how embarrassing it was, eh? Do you know how embarrassing it was sitting here having to make excuses for you? OK, OK, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I should have phoned or something. Can I blame you for not coming back when I treat you like this? I know you didn't mean to do what you did. You just got angry. We're supposed to be trying for a kid. What kind of father would that make? You're going to make a really great father. One day. Do you mean that? 